What you see now does not require any comment. The whole world recognizes aviation and astronautics as the next generation branches of science. Combining creativity, cutting edge science, and the latest technology. In these sophisticated ballet pirouettes, the fighting machine demonstrates grace, power, and strength, merged at the peak of human genius. Hundred years since the first aircraft flight, and throughout all of that time, we have been creating the future of aviation and aeronautics. We are Kharkiv Aviation Institute, now the National Aerospace University, named for Zhukovsky. We are in Ukraine, the state formed in the center of Europe after the breakup of the Soviet Union. Imagine, the Wright brothers first flew in 1903, and by the 1920s, the first aviation department had been created in Kharkiv and was educating students. By 1930, this aviation department had become Kharkiv Aviation Institute. In the following years, the institute, popularly known as HAI, was responsible for a number of famous aircraft legendary high e1 the first plane in europe with a retractable landing gear the high e6 the fastest plane of its time the famous high e fighter the osvia movitz high a tailless glider which was the first in history to perform aerobatics the high e19 and 20 the ancestors of today's high e21 motorized hang glider it was at Hai that the legendary builder, Arhip Luka, constructed one of the first gas turbine engines and then constructed the engine for the Sukhoi 27. From its beginnings until the present, Hai has trained over 60,000 engineers. Hai graduates work not only in Ukraine, but throughout the world. Our graduates were leaders in conquering space launching the world's first satellite, the first space shuttle, and they participated in the International Sea Launch Project. Our graduates participated in the design of many world-famous aircraft, including the Sukhoi 27, the Antonov 70, 72, 74, 140, and the Antonov 225, the largest airplane in the world. In Soviet times, Hai was one of the top universities in the Soviet Union. Today, it is the only university of its kind in Ukraine and one of the largest universities in Europe for the training of aerospace science and technology. Hi, I'm Anurga Sridhar. I'm from India and I'm studying at the Faculty of Airplanes and Helicopter Designing. I chose an uncommon field for girls, airplanes designing. I love sky and airplanes and I enjoy studying in this university. We are staying at hostel and it is located close to the university. I have a lot of friends here and we enjoy time together. Today, HAI is accredited at level 4, the highest level by the government of Ukraine. It is one of the three most popular technical universities in Ukraine and is a member of UNESCO International Association of Universities. HAI offers bachelor's, master's, PhD and Doctor of Engineering degrees. Its 12,000 undergraduate and graduate students study in the seven faculties, 50 majors, and 44 departments of the university, supported by 850 instructors and a staff of 2,000. Now we'll try to briefly present the key elements of our university. The Faculty of Aircraft Design was formed in 1930. Today, it trains specialists in the following majors. Airplane and Helicopter Design, Aircraft Manufacturing, Information Technology Design, Aircraft Maintenance, Alternative Energy Sources, Ecology and Environmental Protection. A distinctive feature of the Faculty of Aircraft Design is its high standards and deep traditions. 
The faculty has modern equipment, a professional approach. It has a strong connection with manufacturing, including a branch at the construction bureau Antonov in Kyiv. The faculty is equipped with wind tunnels, construction halls, and computing facilities. HAI takes pride in its graduates. Among them are general and chief designers of aviation technics, major company officials, public officials, and two heroes of Ukraine. The Faculty of Aircraft Engines is the oldest in the university, as powerful engines have always been the heart of winged machines. Today, the faculty trains master's students in the following majors. Aircraft engines and power plants, aircraft engine manufacturing, aerospace heat engineering, gas turbine plants and compressor stations, and robotics. The training laboratories of the faculty include gas turbine and piston aircraft engines and also diagnostic testers. The department's training and scientific activity is closely connected with the leading industrial giants of Ukraine. No modern aircraft can do without reliable control systems. And the Faculty of Aircraft Control Systems was founded in 1977 during the period of rapid development of aviation and astronautic systems. The faculty trains students in the following majors. Aircraft and Aviation Complex Control Systems, Automation and Control Systems, Information Control Systems and Technologies, Information Measuring Systems, Metrology and Measuring Equipment, Applied Mathematics, and Computer Integrated Technological Processes and Production. This faculty is engaged not only in aircraft and space control systems, but also in computerizing scientific research, manufacturing, technological processes, and in organizational management, and non-conventional measuring and testing. In the 1940s, HIE started to train specialists in space rocket engineering. The Faculty of Space Rocket Engineering trained students in rocket and space systems, aircraft rocket engines, aircraft power plant and engines, and the design and manufacture of products made with composite materials, and the information technology of the sun. Graduates of the faculty make Ukraine today one of the leading space states in the world, producing unique space objects and launching them both alone and through the programs of international cooperation. These graduates took part in designing missile carriers, missiles, and space objects ranging from artificial Earth satellites to manned space stations. HIE graduate Oleg Kononenko completed a prolonged space flight to the International Space Station in 2008 that included two spacewalks. As you know, Modern aircraft cannot do without communication and onboard computer systems. For over 40 years, the Faculty of Aircraft Radioelectric Systems has trained specialists in a range of majors related to the electronics of aircraft and spacecraft, but also to the manufacturing of other products. The faculty trains graduates in the following majors. Production of electronic devices, Biotechnical and Medical Devices and Systems, Radioelectric Devices, Systems and Complexes, Technologies and Means of Communication, Specialized Computer Systems, Computer Systems and Networks, and Geoinformation Systems and Technologies. The scientific laboratories of the university have been engaged in space research and international collaboration and also medical diagnostic research. High age students also study modern banking, finance, enterprise economics, and insurance dealership. Graduates of the faculty have excellent foreign language and computer skills. Specialists from companies, banks, and stock exchanges are involved in teaching at the faculty. 
While studying, students are trained in engineering. Many of the faculty's graduates work in many of the following countries in the world. The faculty trains specialists in the following majors. Organizational management, finance, enterprise economics, software of automated systems, project management, and international economy. HIE's newest faculty is the Faculty of Humanities. It was formed in 1999 in connection with global processes taking place in Ukraine and also the integration of education within the European community. The faculty trains students in the following majors, psychology and applied linguistics. Apart from that, the National Aerospace University has a corresponding faculty where 5,000 students are trained. HIE is a joint participant in the many scientific projects done together with universities and companies from Russia, the USA, Japan, Germany, France, Mexico, China, Finland, and others. HAI takes part in International Program Alpha, Sea Launch, and also EU scientific programs. The university's achievements have been exhibited many times, both at home and internationally, including at Le Bourget, Hanover, and others. They've received more than 300 awards. Everything is done to improve the process of studying in Hawaii, and also to enhance students' everyday activities and leisure. The Hawaii Library has over a million books. In addition, students have access to reading rooms equipped with modern computers. The student's campus is situated in the green zone of the city. There are 10 dorms for more than 6,000 students. This is one of the biggest campuses in Ukraine, and it is located very close to the university. The university has its own preventive clinic, clinic, international communications, bank, and cafeteria. And it has excellent athletic facilities where you'll find a stadium, gyms, a swimming pool and large field house. The number of prizes won by our athletes leaves no doubt about the quality of sporting life at the university. Students' years are the best, and we know that students should have time to rest after their study. And here, Hai is also the leader, as our student life has been legendary for many years. Traditions have been carefully preserved at our university. There are university holidays, High E Day, an initiation into the student body. There are evening concerts and discos, and famous teams where anyone can demonstrate their talents. For example, we have the multiple prize winning dance team Judd, the ballroom dancing group Michta, European prize winner H Blast, and the famous fashion theater Ananas. And of course, there's KVM, the student's comedy theater. CIS Champion Cup winners, the best team of the decade, and the legendary KVN High Team. To make a long story about leisure short, we'd like to close by seeing that the best sport and fitness camp in the Crimea is the High Camp. It's located in the Crimea, not far from Alushta, in the picturesque Rabachai, and is called Icarus. Every year, hundreds of students, lecturers, and staff come here. That's probably all we could tell about Hai in such a short time. The whole story would make an epic film about many generations of talented, keen, and hardworking people. And the result of their work is obvious. Ukraine takes pride in its aircraft industry. I'm Atul Pitambar, currently a fourth year student in the airplane building faculty. This year, I'll get my bachelor's degree in the field of aerospace engineering. It is very interesting to study in National Aerospace University, Kai, but at the same time, very difficult. Basically, we have to do a study general and specific subjects. I found such subjects as mechanics of materials and structures for engineering fundamentals of airplane design very interesting. Uh, I like the professors and teachers of this university. They are very qualified, competent, and well-wishing people like Professor Dimenko, Professor Faratov, Associate Professor Pavlenko, and Senior Lecturer Tenenko, and many other professors who are very qualified and who are here to help us in our studies all the time. I met many new friends in Ukraine, most of whom are from all parts of the world.
маяк космічної родини, численних задумів і трас. Хай надія України, її хода в майбутній час. Хай нам разом будувати, хай нам разом берегти, студентів досвід розвивати, завади всі перемогти. Так слався хай, хай зростає незмінно вагони і плату життя. Хай буде успішний і шлях Україно, щасливим твоє майбуття. Так слався хай, хай зростає незмінно вагони і плату життя. Хай буде успішний і шлях Україно, щасливим твоє майбуття.